Philip to Evelyn, 12 February 1945. Ev, dearest, before leaving for the base theater to see Up in Arms with Danny Kay, Dinah Shore, and others, I want to make sure my daily stint is completed. So if I can think of anything to say, and I'm not at all sure that I can, I'll get on with it. The weather has warmed up considerably, but not so much that we're removing our jackets. We're just not freezing anymore. It was another busy day for me because I had the February payroll to get out. Last month, I did it alone, but this month, Stahl helped me out. He typed as I dictated, and it went pretty smoothly except for the inevitable errors. Anyhow, this kept me occupied most of the day. Tomorrow, among other things, I have the bond issuance schedule to type. That reminds me, sweet. I canceled my allotment for war bonds. I figure it's about time I started to save some ready cash. As I told you some weeks ago, we have a great proportion of our savings tied up in bonds, and it's high time we begin to build a cash reserve. I don't think I'll be able to save much, if anything, out of this month's pay, especially if I take that furlough I told you about yesterday and I must leave myself a few extra pounds to tide me over the birthday, anniversary, Mother's Day, etc. You see, sweet, if I'm to buy you and the moms anything, I have to order two months in advance, so it's not going to be easy to manage this month. Once I get straightened out, though, I'll bank any ex excess funds I may have in soldiers' deposits, which incidentally draws 4% interest. The last bond you receive should be dated 1 January 45. There was no mail for me today, but if you have been writing as per usual, I should be getting a slew of airmail letters any day now. In the meantime, I'm kind of stuck for things to tell you. You can understand from some of the above, honey, that I didn't get much of a chance to do anything about getting to the PX and I can't find a box to ship the what's it in. Right now, time's a wasting, and if I mean to see up in arms tonight, I better get a move on. I'm rather eager to see da this Danny Kay. Remember Helen's records? And I hear he's a wow in this. Tell you about it tomorrow, baby. Until then, I am your adoring Phil. P.S. Best love to the punking. And all, of course.